Hey, what's up, Cancer? It's your girl, Kelly, coming straight at you for the Queen Tarot B. So I wanted to say thank you for your patience while I was away. I did take a break for two months. Um, I had some family things going on with me and Aries, so I had to take a little bit of a break, but I am back, and I'm here to do your July 15th through your July 31st reading. So this is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Mercury, Mars, Venus. Um, let me see. Anything else? Oh, readings. If you guys are looking for personal readings, I am doing them. Um, I was doing them dur during my break as well. If you need um, trauma counseling, um, readings, spell work, light work, candle magic, whatever you might need, uh, my information's in the box below. Um, you can find me on Facebook Messenger under Kelly Bennett Boston, but the Kelly only has one L. And if you don't use all three words, you won't find me. Um, or you can just email me, which is um, kind of off and on because sometimes it goes to spam and I don't see it. Um, or you can Skype me. So uh, reading prices are 15 minutes for $20, 30 minutes, $30, 45 minutes, $40, and a full hour is $50. Okay, let's jump into it. Cancer, I feel like you guys have made many major accomplishments this month. Moving out of Mercury retrograde kind of propelled you forward and it helped you start moving some things. Um, I do feel like it was a there was a tower moment for you. But that tower moment, I feel like it wasn't just one thing that came in. It feels like multiple things came in and Yeah, multiple things came in, and look at that. Tower. I know, they're the holographic cards, and they're hard to see. I'm sorry, guys, but um, these ones are just reading like crazy, and they want to be out, and they want to be present, so we're going to use them. Um, and then the world card. So we've got the tower, the ten of reversed, um, ten of swords reversed, blah, 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 blah. Um, in the world. And so like I was saying, I feel like it's not just one thing that caused this foundation to crumble. I feel like there were several, um, several things that came in all at the same time that just kind of caused it to crumble for you. Oh, shit. That's... Sorry, guys, I just dropped a bunch of cards. So man down. See if I can't get them. That was kind of aggravating right in the middle of a reading. Okay, let's try that again with what fell. We'll go with it, okay, since they fell. And they were very hard to pick up. I'm going to assume that they want to come with this reading, which would make some sense. Because as I was saying, all things fell apart at the same time. So it kind of looks like some of you got ass over tea kettles here by the divine. You must not have been going the correct spiritual way for them or whatever that may be. They ass over tea kettled you. Um, some of you lost a job. Um, or are being overworked at your job to the point where um, what are they saying? To the point where you're not getting paid the money that you should be for the action that you're doing. So you may be stepping in as manager or assistant manager and not getting the pay. You may be doing the role but not getting the pay or the title. Um I do feel like there is a romantic interest at work. I would say leave it alone. Uh, your coworkers are not your dating pool. Don't do it, okay? Everybody does it once and finds out the hard way. Don't do it. Um, it looks to me like you have an instinct about this person anyway that's telling you not to, but you still are kind of on the fence. So if this is your situation and you're finding yourself attracted to a coworker, just know that this coworker is a playboy or a playgirl, okay? And information will end up all over the company. 
Hopefully that's enough to deter you. <laughs> Would be enough to deter me. Um, let's see here. Yeah, I feel like this person either already has or is putting you on the out. It doesn't have to be someone at work. It's just for some people I feel it's a work situation, okay? Um, you've got the Three of Cups in the upright. The Nine of Cups in the upright. And the Four of Pentacles in the upright. Okay. Now to me, this says that there's definitely a third party involved. This is probably not the first time they've done this. So this is someone that may be in your group of friends or new to your group of friends or something along those lines. But this person is a womanizer or a manizer, if you will. Um, so if you haven't hooked up with this individual yet cancer don't and this could be the other way around okay this could be um what cancer's partner is feeling as well and this could be none of your stories it could be all of your stories take what you can leave what you can't throw out the rest um there's definitely a third party situation going on here where someone was disappointed before and the person is emotionally unavailable okay um you see this curtain that's behind it? They want you to pay attention to all of these cups, but not what's behind the curtain. You notice he's taking kind of a protective stance in front of that curtain as though no one's going to open it or get through it. Um, so keep that in mind. Um, if you already have hooked up with this person, they've definitely put you out on the cold. Uh, they left you wondering. I feel like they ghosted you. Or you ghosted them, Cancer. One or the other. There's definitely a ghosting. <laughs> sighting of a ghost here. Um, with the moon reversed, the five of pentacles, and the ace of wands, that tells me that they took off for a new start. So they weren't serious about this endeavor to begin with. Like I said, you know, womanizer, manizer, whatever you want to call it. They weren't intending to put down any roots, um, or you weren't intending to put down any roots. Looks to me right now that for those of you who have lost a job, um, things are going to start easing up on you and going to get easier for you, okay? Um, you've got the Ten of Wands in reverse, so that burden is lifting off of you finally. Um, maybe you're getting financial help. Um, unemployment or disability back pay um, but you are coming through as the Queen of Cups and if you're wondering whether or not you and someone are going to get back together the answer is no Um, this person's gonna, you're gonna go your own way and this person's gonna hermit. Or that could be you, Cancer, pulling in your Cancer shell and, um, hiding away. This person's very sneaky and did not have intention on loving you right to begin with. Um, it looks to me like they... We're just talking a good game. They definitely may have been seeing other people behind your back or are currently seeing other people now that they ghosted you. But there's definitely no family vibe of them coming back right now. Cancer, you may be getting in a little bit of trouble by the divine here. It looks like somebody's been trying to help you financially and you're not allowing that to come through. Or you're blocking a path of financial help. You're not allowing that to come through either. So, um,
the divine is wanting you to open up, open up that path. Don't be stubborn, okay? Everybody gets to a point where they need help sometimes. Um, some of you may have married someone who made a fool out of you, okay? And it's going to come down to... Um, or tried to make a fool out of you. Never let anyone make a fool out of you. Never let them they think they even made a fool out of you. Justice is here. Okay, so we could be talking about divorce here. We could be talking about um, letting old things go. Um, temperance in reverse. So this maybe this divorce has been dragging on. Maybe this divorce has been dragging on for some time now and you've been battling it out with this person over the finances of who is going to pay for it or um, battling out a custody battle. And this is for those of you that are married and had someone who was a playboy or a playgirl around them. Also for the people who we're thinking about seeing somebody at work or did see somebody at work. Um, all right, guys, that is what I have for you for July 15th or July 31st. If you guys need anything at all, since I'm finally back now, you can go ahead and get in touch with me. Don't forget the easiest way is unfortunately Facebook Messenger, um, but you need all three words to find me. So that is what I have for you for this month. I hope you enjoyed your birthday season and I will catch you guys on the flip side. This is your girl Kelly coming straight at you for the Queen Tarot Bee. Bye guys.